Hey what's up guys welcome to find gap and in today's video I am going to teach you how you can add a custom color in Tailwind CSS. So without any delay let's start. First of all you can see that I have created a react project and installed Tailwind CSS in it. The next step is you have to scroll down inside your main directory and you will find tailwind.config.js simply open this file and now here inside the extend section for example we want to define a color you need to simply type here colors and then you will type this object and then inside this you need to define the color name for example fine gap and colon and here you need to define a value i have already copied this, a color here and i will simply paste that color here okay now i will open the app.jsx and here for example i want to give this color as a background i will simply type here bg hyphen fine gap and now let me run the application so i can show you the output in my output you can see that this background color is assigned here for example if i change a class name like fine gap and i just press double p to show you and now if i refresh so you can see that that background color is gone the reason why i did this so you can identify that this background color is coming from here and now for example text colors tailwind css let me type this query on google and for example so i want to assign this color to my text for example text yellow 300 i will simply come and paste this color here and now if i refresh and similarly if i remove this p and you can see that our custom color and a tailwind color both colors are assigned to my this h1 element but now for example if i do one thing i cut this color property from extend and inside the theme i paste this property here i simply do one thing only and now if I refresh, so you can see that the text color is gone. So once you will paste your colors inside the theme, it means you are saying that we do not need any color from our current theme. Each color that I'm going to use, I will define myself here. So this is very crucial. If you want to, uh, if you do not want to use the built-in color in Tailwind CSS, then and only you can uh, paste this property here. Or if you want to use the previous colors and your custom color as well, so then you can do this. Okay, for example, let me cut this from here, and again I will paste here and now refresh, so you can see that my Tailwind, my theme color, and the custom background color is again assigned to our this element. And now, for example, this color have you have multiple shades, like uh, like we do for like yellow. 300 400 500 so how you can define multiple shades so this is how so you need to simply cut this from here define an object and here you will type 100 for example and here you will paste the color simply comma i will copy and paste this line again and here let me type here 2 and for example for second shade just for example i am defining a black color okay so now simply you what you need to do you will simply type here 1 if you will type 100 nothing will change because we have defined the same color but once if you will type here 200 so you know that we have assigned a black color so this is how for a single color you can define multiple shades uh, in the last just for example if you are using any single color but you do not want to add that in your tail uh, when config I mean do you know you do not want to add that in your theme so what you will do let me simply cut this from here i'm going to remove this color property and simply you can do this on the fly for example let me also remove this text color and simply i will type here bg hyphen and simply you will type this big bracket and inside this without any quotation you need to paste this color code and now you can see that nothing is changed okay so similarly let me define another color here for example black so you can see that background color black is assigned okay if i let me type here text and now you can see that the text color is black so this is how you can change a color code on the fly so friends this was the technique that how you can add a custom color in your tailwind css in react.js project i hope that this video will be helpful for you if you have any question you can ask me in the comment section we will try to answer your question and please subscribe to our youtube channel for our regular videos and finally thanks for watching